I'm Mike Morales uh, here in San Antonio. Alex, how's Pasadena? Did I say Pasadena? That's not where you are. Wait, that's the Area 51. <laughs> where the surf meets the turf. Uh, no earthquakes lately, right? No, no, not today. Good. That's what I want to hear. Uh, this evening, we are tasting uh, our first extra añejo for, for sipping off the cuff. This one is unusual because, as far as I know, it comes in a Blanco and an Añejo, but right now, the, this is an extra Añejo, I'm sorry. And um, it's got an unusual name. Look at this packaging. Isn't, this, a isn't, packaging. isn't that beautiful? Show them the box. Show the box. It's got a great backstory. And, and I mean, look, look at this. this. It kind of a little bit reminds me of um, uh, Herradura, Selección Suprema. You know, a little bit like that. The bottle is faceted. It looks a little bit like a perfume bottle, but it almost looks like it's got that flask, like you could put it in your back pocket, you know? Yeah. Um, so we were talking off camera that the name uh, of, the, of the tequila was unusual because you and I are like history buffs. And um, it's named Molly Nolly for the the woman who was who acted as um cortez as a conquistador cortez his um interpreter right. during the conquest of of mexico and we forget i i've completely forgot until i started doing the research that there was a woman involved and she was the official um the official interpreter girlfriend you know, uh, guide among other things, right? And 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 yeah, her. It's, it's an interesting historical piece that they have over there. It's, I, I like I like to read stuff about that. Yeah. I guess this is a homage to, to her. Yeah, and and uh, like I said, beautiful packaging. Uh, you can they're they're on Facebook. They're also their websites uh, full of information. I. Facebook, uh, if you check there, you'll see some recipes for this extra añejo. But honestly, uh, I think I think we should put it through the sipping off the cuff gauntlet, and uh, it's got a really good tight seal on it, synthetic cork. It it won't pour you a shot <laughs> like others. Wow. Look at that color, Alex. That's incredible. Like it's, deep. it's almost brass. Yeah, it's like a brass color, exactly. Look at you. Uh, maybe it's because of where my camera is, but it, it almost looks it looks darker on my camera than it does on yours. But it is like you say, it's like a brass, like a brass red color. Yeah, that's a beautiful color. Beautiful. Oh, whoa! Holy cow! Let me uh, let me jump onto their. Um, onto their website. Now this is an award winner, by the way. They they you know these guys um uh Dimitri Eibinder, I, I hope I'm pronouncing that name correctly, is the CEO of, of Malin Malinali and one of the principals, his name is Greg Promushkin. And Alex uh Greg has written a, a spy novel. And he, let me just get the name of it so I don't I don't mess this up. It's available on on Amazon right now. It's called Tequila Assassin Molly Nolly Way. I haven't read it. Uh, they it's been sent to our offices here. We're gonna do we're gonna read it, do a review on it like we did with uh, with anything that's tequila related. Um, so I'm kind of looking forward to that. But Greg Promushkin and and uh, Dimitri are the two uh, principals in this company. And um, they reached out to us uh, via Facebook, and all I can tell you is, I'm really enamored by this by this nose, man. This is a uh, uh, let me. Yeah, I'm, I want to. Um, they, their, their website is full of information. You know, they, it has a, a video, pictures. Um, yeah, they, um, 
They, they said they, they are generated by slow resting inside 200 liter American oak barrels. Uh, so it's um, in American oak bar barrels. They have a, a little bit of information on their bottle as well. Um, I mean, they're, they're, uh, they're very upfront as to what they're doing. Did you taste it yet? Not yet. Let's go for it. Let's taste it. This is a yeah. That one. That one slipped past the goalie. <laughs> Very nice and smooth. Coming in, and it, uh, it, it, it coats, it coats, it coats your, your, your tongue, tongue your palate. Your palate. It's, it's got, got the right amount of spiciness on the tongue. tongue. It's got a. It's got a good finish, though. I mean, it's got a nice. You know, Alex, for an extra on Yeho. Uh, most often when we taste extra añejos, at least in the past, we've, we've gotten them rather sweet. You know what I mean? There's a, there's a, a sweetness to them. This one doesn't do that. This one, this one has a, a, that good uh, uh, American oak, maybe a little bit of vanilla. Like you said, lots of spices. I get some dried fruit. I don't know about you, but you know, maybe some raisins or dates or something. Oh, like brine. It's like briny. Yeah, but it's very, very good. Oh, oh, yeah. It's not overpowering. It doesn't overwhelm the palate like some do, which just completely controls your palate. Yeah. Which I love too. But this is nice. This is very easy on the palate for. Yeah, it's it it really is no mistaking that this is a tequila. It doesn't pretend to be anything else because of, yeah. of what. Yeah. yeah, I mean, it still it still has that agave punch in it. You don't you don't lose it. Um, and the color is just beautiful. I mean, this tequila. There's a lot happening, on a lot of layers. You know, from 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 the packaging. To the to the bottle, to the story, to the booze, and I call it booze, but you know, it, to the tequila. It's just there's a and you know and it's got it and and who knew that there's one of the one of the principles is written a, a novel you know that includes the tequila in it. Um, this is this is beautiful. If you can find it, I, I say I say brand of promise for packaging and for for the for the juice inside. Oh, I agree. This is this is one you can you can serve after dinner. You can serve. Uh, I would you know, you you probably could do it in a cocktail. You know, for an extra añejo, most often that's not the case. But for me, you know, because I do a, a cigar, be a great te a cigar tequila. Right there, yeah. yeah, and even on the rocks, I think on the rocks it would do really well. You know, I don't think you, you'd lose it too much. But we, we'd have to do that special. We have to do that ice program you were talking you were talking to us about earlier. You know, this would, this would make a great uh, batch. Yeah, if you but if you're going to do it, you you know, it would it would be in a really special uh, cocktail like an old fashioned. Wow, and you know, I get some. I just got some mint or something. There's some there's some herbs. There's a little coffee in there. Wow, you know, it just starts to open up. You're right. There's caramel in there. I got, I got a little bit, like I say, coffee. I don't get any tobacco. I got coffee. It's really beautiful. I don't know what else to say. Yeah, it's one that. It's well, you know, you want to spend more time with it. Obviously, you know, you want to let it talk to you. 
and and you know uh, if you don't have your your Merlot glass, you can serve this in a snifter beautifully. Uh, oh look, you liked it. <laughs> you know, it's an extra Nijo. We don't want to waste it. What were you saying? That's okay. What were you saying? No, I, I said definitely a bread sauce for the packaging. Yes. And, and for the spirit, too. It's, it's definitely a bread sauce for the spirit. I think so. Before, I'd love to try it in a, in a bag. There you go. Uh, I think it, uh, it's got just the right spiciness. Because I, I make my own batches with rye. And rye has that, that spicy, you know, that spicy uh, touch to it. So I, I think this would be great. Well, there you go. Uh, not only is it a, a great sipper, but it's also versatile. So you've got, there's a lot going on with this tequila. It is, uh, like I say, an award winner. Uh, I can, uh, I know that um, uh, my understanding is that it's uh, won several awards, so several medals already. And I think it's a, it, it's a really high runner for us on the Brands of Promise Awards for 2014. So congratulations to to the folks at Molly Nolly for, for to Greg and Dimitri. Great product. Yeah, great product. Uh, very impressed. I'm Mike Morales here in San Antonio. I'm Alex Perez, Southern California. Thanks for watching. Sipping on the cup. And as always, sip wisely.